A Roscoe woman has been staying in Billings after losing her home on Monday. The East Rosebud River rose to levels that destroyed her home along Highway 78. We had a chance to talk with her this afternoon. That river was so angry and so wild. I've never seen anything like it. After 66 years in the small community of Roscoe, Jeanette Ostrom's house is no more. She lost it earlier this week when the East Rosebud River spilled its banks. Her son tried to save it with sandbags, and her daughter also came by on Monday. The river rose around the home and then subsided, and the plan was to come back the next day. It's just the waves were huge, and it was just kept getting bigger and bigger and bigger. And then, you know, it started washing under the house. The river kept eating away at the bank as it was going around the corner, and we could feel boulders literally rolling, you know, as they got closer to the house. Jeanette's daughter, Marsha, was also there to help, and they knew it was time to leave. We were planning to come back the next morning and clean things up. I never dreamt that house would go. Jeanette is receiving a lot of help from her church and the people in Absorkia and Roscoe, a small community rallying around each other in the face of unexpected tragedy. In Billings, David J. MTN News.